right welcome back so today we want to talk about saved views or view map you should be familiar with the project map which contains you know the basic elements here the ground floor first floor like that but then we have something called view map which is saved views and if you haven't watched the videos before i recommend that you do watch them because in there we save these views like here and we show the difference between the two but basically we are just going to explore just something small here because for example we can see that we have something here called a roof plan if i double click on that and thanks to the power of layers and layer combinations that we covered earlier we have ourselves a site plan in the same area it's the same roof plan area but we have used it to create both the roof plan and the site plan so i recommend that video I'll link that to that below if you haven't watched it. So how do you deal with this? Uh, so what we want to do actually is to save our own. So I'm going to collapse everything which is there by default within Archicad such that it's easier for us to create our own. So currently we have ourselves these plans. So I'm going to go ahead and save these by putting them in folders so i'm going to create a folder for working drawings because that's what we are doing working drawings great and i say that is created and you can see that now we can start to organize the plans so for example i can say floor plans first okay and then i will drag these elements these ground first and terrace actually the roof plan as well into the flow plan folder so drop it in there and then we will have a site plan within the within this folder but above yeah let's have it above okay and then we can also create a new folder which is uh, for sections because we're gonna need them and we need schedules as well and this has been formed in there i think it should be out of there and we need elevations as well for this okay pretty cool and for this video we just want to add some schedules in here because we created them before right let's go in here in the project map and you can see we have a door schedule here that we already detailed before so if i click here to fit it to page you can see that this is our complete schedule and all we have to do is right click here and save view and we save it as i think the defaults are really fine i say create and that has been created and then let's also save this window just like that you can see we have ourselves this window schedule and all i want is to save it so i will right click on the tab save view and you can see that we have ourselves this kind of thing going on and a few parameters that you can change if you so wish and then we say save and that has been saved so now we have ourselves these two that we can drag into schedules okay it, that's it so that's how you actually deal with these saved views it's actually easy to work with them so why are we actually doing this why are we putting views views from this side to here well it's because we want to actually simplify the process of putting them in a layout book which we shall talk about later that's it for this video see you in the next one